All right, so now let's talk about the auto top off. Stay tuned. Hey YouTube, it's Brian again, and I'm coming at you with another episode of the 125 gallon reef build. And today I'm gonna to show you what I'm using for an auto top off on this uh, tank. I chose the Tunes Osmolator 3155. There's two versions, one's a Nano, and then there's this one which is bigger, and so I went ahead and used this. And I gotta tell you, so far I'm just loving it. Um, I used the JBJ auto top off on my Nano, on my BioCube. And I gotta be honest, this is, to me, a much better piece of machinery. Um, the uh, float on uh, my JBJ get, seems to get stuck quite often. And with this, you don't have to worry about that because it's actually got a sensor, and that's what's shown right here. But uh, I'm not gonna go through a full unboxing, but I will show you uh, it as it's set up. All right, so here we are underneath the tank, and as you can see, I've got, uh, I'm using a 20 gallon fish tank uh, for my um, uh, auto top off reservoir, this is where I keep the RO water. Here's the controller for the unit. As you can see, it's got three different lights and indicators there, too low, pump on, level, and too high. The light's lit up on level right now, so that's good. Um, as you can see down here, there's a small little pump that goes underneath the water. That's what pumps the water out through the hose and over through that mess and over to here. And the water comes out here, this hose, and goes into the tank. comes with a nice little uh, bracket to attach it. And then down there is the uh, unit. It's got, it's got a magnet on it, so you can adjust it. Um, that uh, has the sensor and actually a backup flow. Um, so that sensor senses the water getting low and it uh, then turns the unit or tells the unit to turn on and start pumping water in. Pretty simple. Let's see if I can get you a better shot of it. little thing that sticks down into the water there when it gets too low below that the pump turns on um, I've just had really good luck with it so far I'm really pleased with it it is a little loud when it runs but that's for like less than a minute um, so it's not a huge deal I definitely will be switching over to the tunes nano osmolator on my on my bio cube when I uh, have the time and money to do so but for now, I'm real happy with this. So that's really all I've got for you on this one. I just wanted to show that to you. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. If you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe uh, to see all the uh, different episodes of this reef build series, as well as all my other videos, including freshwater, saltwater, and freshwater shrimp. Um, thanks to everybody that does subscribe and watches these videos. I really appreciate it. Stay tuned until the next one.